Say hello to my bird Wilder. He he's my sweet precious little baby. Yes, yes you are. I have not been in here yet. Please don't blow up anything. Because the goal of this is for me to move in here. No! Come on! It's just just wool. I don't like how dark that is. Ah! Run away! Nigero! Ah, dang it! Did he see me? Ah, he saw me! Ah, look at my wonderful collection of boats. Ah, dang it. Oh! Oh! Oh no, oh no, oh no, 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 no. Heck no, I am not prepared to deal with this. I am back. I have some arrows. I also found some some iron that I misplaced, so I made some flint and steel. So, oh god, come on! Can I not set him on fire? Oh shoot, the whole place is on fire. Yep, yep. I'll be back, Wilder. Oops. Oh, there's so much lag. Save the books! Ah! Jeez. For goodness sake! <gasps> Wait for me, Wilder! Hello, everyone! Welcome back to Minecraft! So, I made it back home. I actually did find my way, and we will go over that in a little bit. How do people control things like this? Like, this is... that that is awful. Um, as you can see, the garden is mostly bare. That is because we are not here for a long time or a fun time. We are here to pack up my stuff, which I actually already did. And we are getting out of here because I moved since the last... Hello? Let's get out of here! See ya, suckers! <laughs> um, yeah, I decided that this is not the place for me. Totally not just me raging because of all the horrible luck I had. But I, I just, I wanted a new place. I wanted somewhere greener and flatter and just prettier than that. And with no freaking pillagers or illagers or whatever the heck those ones are called. So yeah, uh, I'm not going to show you this whole voyage because this takes like a day and a half. Minecraft time. So instead, I am going to show you what's been going on since you last saw me. So unfortunately I lost the first bit of footage of me trying to find my way back and what you currently seen is what happened after I died again. So um, I respawned in the beginning place and I went back to that desert tomb, temple, whatever the heck, I'm gonna call it a tomb. And I got all of the dynamite from there, because I thought, hmm, this might be useful at some point. But anyways, I did manage to find my way back to the shipwreck where I died and got all of my stuff. And I decided to spend the night there. Now, in the clips that went missing, I do remember that I found a broken nether portal which I got some stuff out of the chest from, and I found a couple more villages where I was scavenging for armor and food, and getting a lot of wheat. After spending the night on the shipwreck, uh, I decided to head out and follow the treasure map that I found. And I was very disappointed when I realized that it led me back to the treasure I had already dug up. Uh, the turtle was very happy to see me, but um, I, I was kind of disappointed. Anyways, disappointment aside, I went roaming around for like a day and a half, and then I came across a desert. Uh, what is the word? 
village. So I went gathering wheat again. But that's not why I'm showing you this. I am showing you this because I found a camel in the game for the first time and I was just so fascinated with this thing. It was adorable. And if I had had a home at the time, I probably would have brought it with me. So after roaming around for another two days, yeah, two days, I came across the first shipwreck that I found and I decided that I was going to use that as my return spot so i was i started off going into the shipwreck and then going off straight and just seeing wherever i got to and the first place i got to was back to that first place where i found treasure and yes the turtle was still there i think he's decided to live there now after that i went off in a random direction from the treasure point and I found myself near the jungle which was pretty exciting and I did stop to ask a local for help and he gave me directions and following them I actually ended up near a jungle area that was also near a wooded area so I went around hoping to see either home or that stupid mansion that was the cause of all of my misery Unfortunately, I did not find that there and ended up in open sea again. Now at this point, I had kind of given up on ever finding home and I decided that wherever I land was just going to be my new home. And then I noticed something super cool underneath me as I was going along the water and then got cursed. And just as I was thinking that this evil panda sent me on a losing quest losing mission lost cause that's what i want to say i saw something literally not even a minute after i had gotten cursed i had found my way home i actually made it the panda knew what he was talking about he sent me back home so yeah i was super excited i ran back inside and greeted Wilder, who was very excited and also very eager to go to bed because the poor child had been awake, waiting for me to come back because I told him I was coming back. And then I didn't for like a whole week. But I made it back and went to sleep, happy and safe in my own little bed. So I was curious and I decided to go check the mansion, which, by the way, was still on fire. And also to collect my boats again, because if you remember, I had put all the important things in the chest attached to the one boat, so obviously I needed to go that. But as I was collecting my boats, I noticed something. My stuff was still in this mansion. So I went back to the mansion the next day to see if there was anything else I could scavenge, and somehow or the other... The wool had survived, or a lot of the wool. So I gathered some of that, and I did make an effort to try and put out the fire. Um, I was not very successful, and I had to bail on that mission after a while, because I think it was a skeleton that started attacking me. But yeah, I did try. I tried, okay? I tried to undo the mess that I made. So that, that counts for something. And I went back again the following day because I wanted to grab the books because books are important also it saves a lot of time to just get books instead of having to kill a bunch of cows to make them later on so because I was trying to put out the fire there was some water below me and I decided that I was gonna jump into the water so I would have a fast way down instead of trying to figure out how to build my way down or something and I backed up and fell to my death <laughs> Very, very clever. Although, luckily, I did spawn back in my house. So, I very quickly went back, got a bunch of the empty chests, and got my books, and then I left, never to return again. That, that was such good timing <laughs> with my rambling. But, yeah... This is my new home. This is actually the back entrance, but um, it, it needs to be daylight to fully appreciate the other side. 
also I have my things in this boat so I don't they, I'll explain it in the morning but anyways welcome to my new home ah come on that is not the welcome party I wanted go away go away go away go away so I wasn't really supposed to show this place until I was done with it but uh, things happened and now I want to show you oh I'll explain the llamas in the morning for now look at this floors look look at this also excuse the purple windows I had the die and didn't know what to do with them so I I created that also say hi to Wilder he's here yes hi and this is Dodger hi boy I'm back but yeah I will give you a tour in the morning oh come on Oh gosh, are they on the roof? I haven't sealed off the roof. Down. Ugh. Yeah. I'm re really not done building the place. Okay. There's a skeleton dying on my roof. Did I not tell you to get down? Really? You couldn't even leave stuff for me? Is it in the hole in the floor? Okay, not the hole in the floor, the hole in the- Oi! Get away from my llamas! Whoa, whoa, whoa! I need food! I need food! Oh boy, that was... Dumb. How did my health get so low? Where is it? Hey! I can't see it. Come, boy. I require your assistance. Where's the freaking skeleton? Oh! Jeez! Get him! <laughs> so, Dodger I actually found out in that wooded area. And, okay, let me explain the llamas. So, I actually recorded this. So while I was wandering around, after I had found my way back home, I realized that there was a... Yes, hello everyone. I realized that there was a desert village right nearby. And one day when I went there, there was a wandering trader there. And his llamas fell into a hole, and he just left them there, leaves and all. So... Wilder and I hopped in and rescued them and brought them home. And uh, the next couple traders who came over, I may or may not have built little llama traps. And if they abandoned their llamas, I kept them. There was one guy who actually refused to leave his llamas. So I didn't take them. But yeah, I now have six llamas. I know I gave all of them names, but I I don't remember all of them right now. I know the pink one I named Kobe. The red one was Flannery. The the blue one over here. Oh uh, gosh, what did I name you? CL! <laughs> I named him CL. Um I think I named the brown one Sandy. No, I was going to name it Sandy, and then I thought of a better name. What was the better name? I actually do not remember. I am terrible. But yeah, I, I will rename them and actually remember their names. Yes, hello. Also, that one is attached... Oh, I think it's this one that's attached there. Because apparently, if you attach one llama to a thing, any other llamas up to nine in the vicinity will just kind of stay. So, yeah, I have llamas. <laughs> but anyways, um, ah, oh, jeez, the other boat is on that side now. Hang on, let me get another boat and show you around. Okay. Wait. A while there, did you just fly off my shoulder? Anyways, uh, that giant tower over there is how I normally find my way. So... There should be another boat here. 
So normally I come in through this way and then I have a boat here to bring me in. So there's a flower biome a little out there. I will take you there at some point. And I wish I had recorded this, but when I went to get blue flowers, a bee started following me. Now, I do not like bees in real life. So I saw a bee following me and not realizing that it was doing this because I had a flower in my hand, I started running. And then I stopped hearing the buzzing, so I thought I was safe. Just to get here and realize that this freaking bee had sat in the boat with me and came back. So I planted some flowers and he did come and pollinate one of the purple ones. And then he flew off. I planted a tree hoping he would build a beehive here, but uh, he never came back. So that sucked. But anyways, this area I was clearing out a little. And these are my chickens. I needed to keep chickens because I need arrows until such time as I can enchant a bow to give me infinite arrows. But yeah, this is what I really wanted to show you and why I'm actually making this video. I was clearing this area out to turn it into a mine and I found lapis right away. Like, surface level lapis. What level are we on? Like, I thought you had to be a little further down to get lapis. But anyways, I don't have the right pickaxe on me right now. Um, that button. No, I, I have cherry saplings with me. Why did I not put that in a chest? Okay, you stay there. Okay. Dodger can come with. He He's very good for mining things because sometimes I stay out late and the skeletons come for me. So he's allowed to come with for mining. He's been very good. He's only gotten in front of the pickaxe once and never again. But anyways, this is now going to be my mine since we have a very obvious starting point. So yeah. Today is the day I apparently start the mine. I'm recording this in hopes that we're gonna find something cool. I do have... Okay, I do have some... What do you call them? Torches. My vocabulary sucks. Why do I have... Why did I not make more shovels? It's fine. I have a working bench up over here on this part of my homeland. But yeah, eventually I'm going to... Yes, apparently we've hit water. Okay, maybe this isn't going to be my mine. Come boy, get out of there. Oh, my torch. Thank you. Okay, I will just seal this area up and... I would go in that direction, but actually, how far is the ocean? I think it's still pretty close. Yeah. Maybe we could mine there. That is gonna be tomorrow's problem. Come boy, let's go home. And I'll make more shovels before I leave the house. Where is my dog? Puppy, where are you? Oh, you're up here. Good boy, sit. Hey, I still need to bring my stuff from the boat in. One problem at a time, one problem at a time. Okay. I'm busy building up this beach because eventually I want to bring turtles in. Because we have a lot of squid and salmon. So next is obviously turtles. Let's see, I have mined down here a little. I can't remember what it was. Oh, I was getting this to make the stairs in the house. Okay. Why is there just water everywhere here? Then again, I kind of want that. Why did I not bring food? I am so disorganized. Oh! Oh, 
This is where you've been. Hi, I need to bring him a friend. I only have the one donkey here. Okay, still more water there. We have piggies, apparently. Where is going to be a good place to mine? Preferably somewhere where I'm not going to accidentally drown myself. Ooh. We will investigate that some other time. Hello, chicken. You know what, Let, let's just go in here. I just realized I don't have Dodger with me. Who's barking? Let's just see where this takes us. That, that might be a bad idea. Oh, but there's steps. Oh, nice. I can make myself a new set of armor. The one I have is a little worse for wear. In fact, I think my helmet is gone. Is that Lapis? Nice! Oh! Um. Oh! That looks promising. Let's see if we can get down there. Or am I just on a ledge? Oh, of course, I'm on a ledge. Okay. Oh, still up on a ledge. That's okay. We can make this work. <gasps> Diamond! Okay, we're getting closer. Ooh! Gold! Oh! Um... Yikes! Oh. Oh, well, this is convenient. Doesn't seem like there's anything out to get me. Hello there. Is, is it just the one of you? I'm not complaining, I'm just curious. Oh? Still no one out to get me. Nice! Okay, well, this was... a very nice excursion. Oh, jeez. Okay. Time, time to leave. Very quickly. Must go. What? Where? What? Oh no. Go away! Go away! Go away! Go away! Die! Where did I come from? I mean, if it's there, then I should have come from up. Oh, yeah. Everything is the same color, okay? It's hard to see. Okay, that was successful. I don't want to have to run around the whole thing just to get back. Can I just tunnel my way straight through? This is my last pickaxe, though. I made it! Oh, that's going to be so easy to get to next time! There's a spider jumping up and down. They're very excited, like... I don't need to kill the spider. Okay, I should just keep an extra boat here, then. Nice! Let's just swim there. Swimming is faster. Hello, fishies! Hello? Oh, need to breathe. 
Never seen that before. Should actually plunk more sugar cane. But anyways, um, this is home. I'm gonna build up a lot more as we go. I still need to get my stuff out of the boat. My wonderful waterfalls, my new farm at the edge of where the biomes change. And I still got that whole area I need to explore. I mean, I could probably climb up. What is that? Is that... Oh, drowning. Is that a tree or is... I don't know. Maybe we'll go exploring up there the next time. I don't know. But yeah. Hopefully my house will have a roof the next time I record an episode. Yes, hi, you can come with it now. Let's go get the papa from the roof. So yeah, everything is officially moved here. We have the pets here. We have fancy floors. I have plenty of clay so I can keep making more fancy floors. And we have my wonderful little pack of llamas. Alpacas? Are they llamas or alpacas? I... I don't know. I'm gonna call them llamas. But yeah, hopefully you guys like my new home. Hopefully this episode wasn't too boring. I mean, we went exploring. I gave you a whole backstory of how I got here. It featured camels and llamas and all oh, my pets. They they so... oh, I adore them. All right! I... I... I recorded this one but just to use as a thumbnail, which you would have already seen. I did take Dodger back to the jungle so he could see where we were all coming from. And that was the trip that I brought Wilder back. And also I decided to bring two llamas with. And that was terrifying because sometimes these things decide to get off the leash in the middle of the ocean. Not fun. But uh, we made it. We're all here. Come on, everyone get together. How do... There. There we go. We're all here. Our new home. It's very exciting. So, yeah. Hang on. I need to press the button. There, there we go. That's better. Everyone's here. In the brand new home. Why I thought you were going to sit on my shoulder. D are you... Okay. No, he's doing his own thing. But yeah, that is it for this episode. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to like it. Leave me a comment. And this bird is trolling me. Like, just land on my shoulder, dude. And if you want to see more Minecraft whenever I post it, be sure to hit subscribe. Thank you. And book the bell. I'm just posting the llamas in my head. Like, there we go. Anyways, um, I don't have a schedule for this. I'm just posting whenever I think I can get an interesting video. Oh, that's so cute. We got all of the pets. Ah! Maybe this will be the thumbnail. But anyways, um, this outro is too long. I keep mixing the words intro and outro. It's so dumb, but I keep doing it. But yeah, that is it. Dude, okay, he wants to go inside and play. I'm gonna go before my dog knocks all of us into the water um hit subscribe book the bell you can also find me on tiktok instagram and my main youtube channel i just posted a video there on my top five favorite anime father figures and yeah that's all i have to say so yeah until the next video you just keep rocking D is he actually trying to push them into the water okay okay dodger i'm coming bye